Howdy y'all, it's your host Road. Welcome back to Love It Games. Today we are going to be playing Dredge. I don't know much about this game, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're going to hop right into it. Went ahead and purchased the game, all the DLC. So uh, let's hop right in. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. New game, Dredge in the Depths. Job listing, Angler Wanted. I love the art style. Morning light fills your eyes and you can sit upright. You're lying on the cold wet dock where you collapsed the night before. The short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers. Just embarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to the Greater Morrow, I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. See you already induced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah well. Glad to see the new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later and discuss more details. I'll let you get out of here to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in and keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. That's undock. Cab. Okay, so this, I guess, is our boat. We have a motor. I'm going to turn this engine to an unfamiliar way whenever they seem. Got giving it more power than normal. Okay. Basic fishing pole. Doing damage. Pursuits. Catch a fish for the day. Met with the mayor of Greyer Morrow, who sent me out to catch some fish and find my bearings. Seems nice enough for me to be back before night fell, oh, though. No. Said something about fog, a bit dramatic. Mayor asked me to catch as many fish as I can, then return. I'm guessing these are the DLCs, because they were the names. Matt. We are dead center. Okay. Some dock. The forward W. S reverse ASD. Alright. Rotate the camera. Adjust the height. Well, here's some fish. Start fishing. Blue mackerel. Can I rearrange this? No. Blue mackerel. Blue mackerel. Stock low. Blue mackerel. Blue mackerel. Depleted. All right. Rotate camera. Fishing spot. Disturbed water. You don't have the right equipment for this. Okay. You got a cod.
Deleted. Time only advances when you're moving or fishing or take other specific actions. Third water, you don't have the right equipment. Kinda wanna see what this bottle thing is. Like I know. Oh, don't run as short. You don't have the right equipment. Okay. It is starting to get late. I don't know what time sundown is. Ropey caught. Blue mackerel. It is six o'clock, so we probably should head back. Don't have the right equipment for that one. Ew, it did get spooky as it got to nighttime. Real quick. Right, let's head on back. It's eight o'clock. What's with the creepy eye? I've got to hold it. Okay. Step on the dock at Greater Morrow, the mayor's waiting nearby. Ah, I see you returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you the, that replacement vessel of yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand. So consider it alone, but I want to make this easy mm. for you. Tell your dad's repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you need to sell fish to your local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understood? The selling fish helps the town and pays off my debt. Got it. Off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Okay, so fish spoil apparently. Ship loan payments, fifty dollars remaining. We got storage. Um we got something under tab. Let's see. Pursuits. Sell fish at the monitor. Okay. Messages. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day prosper. Today we're sailing around the island for the inlets back to the greater morrow. I love the rocks here. The layers of colors are so striking. Further fishing is so relatively poor in these shallows. But I know I will keep my hands on the wheel instead on the rods. He renamed the boat last night. Julie did a fancy renaming ceremony. I think you took it more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly it's very important to perform it correctly. Thus you want ill fortune to follow the best. You wanted to throw away everything with the old man, but I kept the keychain ocean riches. It's a good name. I think he has prepared a surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half hidden and stuck under a blanket in the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. Oh, so... There's the arrow squid looking thing, blue mackerel and cod. Fishmonger. You enter the squalic shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around the downcast man behind the counter. Mm. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He it takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. 
Anyway, it's the business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are worth more too. Other towns and other islands may pay you different, but while well, you still got an outstanding debt here, I suggest you work and paint it off first. Let's see what you got. Practically worth this, but enough to starve off hunger. Have to pull them fresh. So to storage middle or to sell. Do I want to sell a trophy fish? I don't know. We're definitely making our money here. I don't know what a trophy fish is supposed to be like. Alright. So we just made 200 and almost $60. Mayor is standing outside the fish monitor store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you can make some out of it. Why don't you take it? Research part. Here's like increased developed new equipment. Alright. One last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Oh, we only owe four dollars left. Wow. As you walk in the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damage hole. She looks at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front and everything takes time to install. Also, if you take any damage from the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she currently is attempting to repair. A number of wooden barrels, all well above the water line, are splintered in the sky. Take a lot, look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. That's a weighted line. That's the simplest demo. Fishing speed 35. Catches coastal. Catches shallow. And this is a weighted line. Fishing speed 40. Operational. Press the onboard engine. Don't really have the ability to use nets yet. I would definitely like a light. Additional rod for shallow fishing. It leaves us with a hundred bucks. Alright, so we got two engines now, two fishing rods. Really wanted a light, man. Guess we'll save up for that. Um, it's hard to uninstall. And it's going to storage? Press, oh, research. This is how you do it. Hydraulic rod. Use parts to research new equipment. Research equipment will appear for shop and I wish I did that beforehand. Alright, so it is nighttime. We should rest until dawn. And undock. 
Oh wow, we are a lot faster. I was not prepared for that. The floating buoy serves to mark safe passage past dangerous rocks. The might also provides a brief respite from the human light. But can I fish these guys now? I can. Not fit many of these though. Do one more. are so poorly put in here. Can I dock over here and sell? I'm assuming, hopefully. You got a trader? In our brightly lit ship shop it's packed with antique shells and full of jewelry and other baubles. Old man pairs at you over silver spectacles. Hello, is that? No, I don't believe so. We've not met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. You got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Just fish. Alright. We will undock. Oh, hey, don't hit the rock. That was close. So we definitely are faster with two engines. I think they're both kind of like Freddy engines. We may be able to pay off our debt though today. Alright. Fishmonger. <gasps> Special order come through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay above normal prices. Mm. Here's the order. One gulf flounder and one gray eel. Let's bring them when you have them. You need a shallow water fish rod. Mm. Mm. This is a flounder. Alright, come back when you have everything else. Some for fish, yeah. No, some fish like deeper water. That's fine. Sell all fish. So, Mayor's quickly walking towards you. He seems to be in a good mood. Spring is tech. Fantastic news. Thanks to your partial efforts, the greater tomorrow is growing. Town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, you granted a consent from the shipwright to expand your facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. We've also allocated some money to the fishmonger services. We might have something to talk to you about very soon. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. So can I... That does shallow. That does coastal. That's a lot of money. Dry dock. Ah. This is dry dock. We can make significant improvements to your vessel here. Take in extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even secure holes. We need a decent stock of hard materials for these lumber and metal scraps right there. How do I ah. get these? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get to them. The materials assigned towards upgrade will be stored. Don't worry if you don't have half of what we need. Okay. We need to find eels. Oh, this is weird. That's 
not ready for uh, to be like that. getting dark. Oh, it is incredibly dark. Dude, what's with the red? Oh of like evil. Hold your lights, toggle them with Okay, we don't have any lights. So I was trying to get enough money to work on. Got any fish for that order? Yes. Wrapped up the fish, hand you some money. Good, good. Should we please with these? And another order here. This one's a little more curious. A couple of squid and a black grouper. I don't see many people fishing squid these days. They're only fed at night. Very well, you know, nights are like rather light. Any fish for that order? Do I? I have a grouper. Come back when you have anything else. Found this book. Not back. Could be useful. Fishmonker reaches on the book, hands you a damp, battered book. A few shimmying fish scales are stuck to the cover. Right, we'll sell all the fish. Um, let's see if we can go ahead and get our light. I. Does it have to be there? It does, doesn't it? I just don't like the way those are set up. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps like yeah, She stops from a distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? Come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do you yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back up the path that leads to the light. That was nice. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing east out towards Little Morrow? Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Yeah. Oh, well, I'll come back when you have more space. Why can I take it? There, hand you a small damp package. Dog work will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you're lost. On the shelf, ready. Rods, reels, and rigs. Okay, pursuits. We have to deliver a package. Need to get two squid. Need to go to Little Morrow. Little Morrow is the one straight across from us. You will rest until dawn.
completed stock. I only get one of those. Ah, oh, what a delivery. Let me see here. He tears small on the paper, picks up. Can't tell you for sure, but it feels out he's shielding some of you. A nice approach. That's a good nice thing. I'll pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. Mm. You gave an old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. I'm sure you'll get more use out of it. Pull the crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it when you're on the water. Stop by for chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. Undock. We honestly need to go sell some stuff. It doesn't cough and use my light, does it? Because I'd like to pretty much always have that on. Back up, Terry. Coming in quick. <sighs> Lousy weather today. I almost thinks you will not want to get out of bed, but you and I, we've got to do it. Hey, we're almost what people who keep people from going to drink. Alright. we got like three hours worth of fishing left. Not a whole lot. We have a light now. Um, depleted already. I don't know if I can do these big fish yet. Yeah, I'm right equipped. Electrolyze the E. Yeah, lights are already on. been depleted. That's kind of cool looking. Oh, oh. I heard something. Was that light? I literally just saw a weird light. Oh, it is the lighthouse. That was creepy looking. I was about to be attacked by something. Oh, you got any fish for that order? Yes. Alright, whatever you have, hand it here. Are these worth more? Doesn't really say. Sold three fish for 122. <sighs> Thank you, Annie. Night fishing is a tall order. Me and meaning to talk to you about a new business venture. I've been. Considering crab pot. Mm. I got one here for you, in fact. It's a bit banged up. We get it fixed up with a ship shipwright. It'd be pretty straightforward. Just drop it out and see anywhere and come back after a day or two to check on it. 
Got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both can be found around here. <laughs> This is 34.25. I don't want to buy that just yet. I'm sure, right? What do you got? Try that. Ah. Pulls a book from a toolbox, hands it to you a few pages, are stuck together with grease. Fun. Well, apparently, we did get damaged. Go ahead and do a repair. Wait, what does this do? That's oceanic. Now, what's that over shallow? Do not know. We're almost done reading this. We're going to undock, head back out. over here. Right now we're doing pretty good just here in this cove. Check for buttons. All right, tab, cabin, rods and real fishing, ten percent more efficient. Read that book. I don't know how or where to drop the crab pot. This thing is massive. Um. I don't think there's any way I could have to discard it. Don't have what I need to dredge. What is this? to sell what we got. Why are you... Oh, that's how you do it. 
Oh, we're already here. Night fishing. Nothing can go wrong with some night fishing. Pleasure of fog and other increases your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Panic. Why'd my light go out? Don't overcommit yourself, especially when the sun starts to go down. Better to come back with a small catch than not come back at all. We got 500. Lasts for three days. We will rest. And then dock. Do I need to check on this pot? Like, I don't quite know what we do with it. I would like to get a whole upgrade. Cargo upgrade if I can. Hey, there's some shiny over there. Whatever this shiny thing is. The DHD for you. There's a little lighthouse in the distance. I can't quite tell.
the main to buy more crap pot. Tiny crabs, yes, don't forget. It's a piddler crab. If your crab hack is a bit worn out, the shipwright will be able to patch them up. Back when you have. What is it today? He has a grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raises the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Ah, now this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day, huh? I wonder. Runs his finger along the length of the fish as to feeling for some. Pushes one side of its stomach and a small shape can be seen, bulging scales. Plus, the fish up and from his stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. The delicate pattern handkerchief. I've never seen this before in all my days. I'll give you this thing. I'll pay you for the fish too, of course. Not the first corrupt fish I've seen in these parts, so I'm sure you'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well for any more you find. Once beautiful handkerchief drawn in sides of a grotesque fish, pattern delicate. Interesting. Can I help it? Get a few of these. I don't know how long it's gonna take. Man, look at either your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. Know what you took to the fish marker. To be clear, I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet on Blackstone Isle. Head out there to this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. So, I need the thing for my storage, then. We'll undock. Alright. Put the crab pot with E to deploy. We catch things over time, but need repairing every so often. Uh, uh. Cabin. 10% chance to not reduce fish stocks and catch to fish. Cool. What does this need? Drop one of you here. a little closer. Alright, I need my light. We're gonna do some night fishing. If we can find anything. I don't see a single fish. Get all. Not to this island. Ruin mansion workshop for storage. The man standing in the doorway watching your approach. He's holding an old book in one hand, bound in crimson with silver ribbons. <sighs> You came, good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasure and truths. The curios that occupy the purposy of desire. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector, he holds it to the flickering light and studies mm. it. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. Thank you many years ago. Carried items of great importance, as you can imagine. Retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfish, outfit your vessel with equipment that will allow you to dredge from wrecks and dark depths. Find me these ro lost relics and I will reward you in ways beyond all your imagining. 
You need not to give up your pristine career. I merely need a few hours with your vegetable to make it necessary alterations. What do you say? Oh. Excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. The relics we're looking for a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I encourage you to ask around the towns about the shipwrecks and other occurrences, anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. The workshop. The workshop looks like it hasn't been used in decades. From inside, you enter, take a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. Find some horrifying creations amongst the debris. The sign of ruin. Assemble a deep sign carved into a small tassel. Be sure to draw the attention to those attuned to it. And then in arterial engine, the bony blades of this rotesque engine are driven by the pulsating heart. It beats the time with your own. Do how do I oh, storage storage? We will rest until morning and undock. Ah, I just hit the dock. We got over here. bit of fish that we can. Alright. So he said we should be able to now dredge. And I dredge this. I have to change lanes. I don't... I don't get what I'm supposed to be doing. Am I just dodging the holes? I wish they had gave a better explanation before you just hop into it. the crab. Ooh. Big boy crab. that one. Yeah, I got two of the big boy crabs. Hi, fisherman, have you run into the photographer on your travel? She stopped here a few days ago for supplies. It suggests that she takes some pictures of town for a promotional purpose. She doesn't seem too interested. You mentioned she's heading south. Perhaps you should introduce yourself. Mm -hmm. I'll sell this. You got any crabs? Yes, don't forget. Crab pots. Worn out. You should patch them up. Hand you some money. That'll do. You should always buy more here or repair damage on the shipyards. One final for request for you. As you see, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens to a person who eats flesh on one of those mutants? They get sick? <laughs> well, perhaps, but I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish, any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. I got nothing else to do with the crab pots for now, so. Not those. White House Keeper. 
What is it? You know any shipwreck changer? She eyes you suspiciously. Mm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Mara where the current carries its wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from a patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you move on. Go. Builder. Approach a woman sitting on the dockside staring out of the sea. She turns mm. to you. What's it like out there? It's peaceful. Gotta be damn straight. Better than living in the bloody town. I think I need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards isn't a mistake. Don't you think you should always keep moving forward, moving along? Not so bad here. Just get down to the sea again and lost some thoughts. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can. Help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about. Still point, just to the north. Two units of lumber, two units of scrap's all I need, and I can make a new place for myself up there. You'd be welcome to visit, too. You stack it up at the still point where when you have anything, I'll pay you when the job is done. So, I'm gonna throw this in there. Worn out gold ring. And we will... Undock. Undock. Check all our traps real quick. Uh, that. We will pick you up. And we will pick you up. What is that? Post eel? What in the world? How's there a rock here now? Back to town. We finished reading our book. Mm -hmm. uh, have you got any of those mute? Yes. Remember, any abhorrent will sacrifice the spike, they all have the same underneath. Dishwater takes the aberrant fish from you, clutches it close to the chest. Reeling his hands out of his flying body. Yes, this should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth. Why don't you take these as well? Pick up. Pick up. Oh, did you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whisperings. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger hands begin to tremble. His face grows acknowledged. Please, sell what you ha need and then leave. I must deal with this creature quickly now. Alright, so we made some decent money. Slams the door, you hear a heavy scrape and a metal bar sliding across. Oh, sweet. So this allows you to catch combination things. We have two. 
That'll do coastal and shallow. That is oceanic. So. Then. Then install you. Storage for now. Then install you. Storage for now. You over here. How do I get cargo? Alright, so we are set up there. I think we're pretty good. Nothing to repair. Got a good feeling about that the engines will take you far away reliable provided you take good care of them. Alright, nothing really fair. Let's undock. We're gonna check all of our crab traps. I will pick up crap truck. Oh crap. That still's got two days. That's got two days. Eleven hours. I'm gonna pick that one up. I'm gonna go repair these. Fell off the crab. I think we have too many of them out to successfully manage right now. Doors barred from the inside. Uh, pair off. Storage. Is barred from the inside. What am I supposed to do with my fish? Do I just throw them into storage for now? fish you guys yet? Mm. 
Dude, you're huge. I don't know if there is a way I can actually maneuver this. Not to discard. It sucks. Hey, there's some sparkly over here. Playhouse above waves crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bones broken, thrown at its feet. You ponder the instruistic power of the structure and fall. The stone shuddering the responsibility of countless lives. But how will, long will it stand? How long will it until it decays into ruin? Purpose exhausted. The lighthouse towers above. to do with all my fish. Engines required high more movement speed than previous. Two pursuits. Four pursuits. Two lumber, two scrap, search for relics. Okay. Messages. We had a slight accident yesterday. Shells at the back of Greater Morrow. The rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. Did not penetrate the hole, but a jostle us around. A few items fell overboard in the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern. But we believe the important articles are accounted for. He's been checking over some notes. The boat renaming ceremony. He's paranoid that he performed the steps incorrectly. I have never known him to be so superstitious. Blackstone Isle at the Marcus for. Those are our crab pots. Oh. Okay. So, I mean, it's late. Undock, I guess. Ooh, another creepy fish. Volcanic grouper. See, what I do not like is, uh, we have not been able to sell our fish. We want to storage. Our storage is getting full. Grieving father. Hello, is everything okay? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes. Yes, you see, my only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold, dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but the tremors of grief rack his body. I was wondering. I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed in your vessel. If you are able to retrieve any of its belongings from the wreck, I think I'd feel more at peace if the mementos were with me. For a bronze belt buckle specifically engraved, 
I'd recognize it anywhere. If there was a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Anything else I could help you with? What's the thing? <sighs> Fisherman, I heard you might stop by. Welcome to my humble studio. You're wanting to experiment with some decorations, yes, I'm a person to talk to. Hmm. Sort of decoration. Attach flags and bunting to add some style to your bow. I've designed here already that you may like. Find any others on your travels, bring them to me and I can rig them for you. Of course I can add this fashion color to your hole. Sorry to say my selection of pigments is limited at the moment though. Can hmm. I help find more pigments? Oh. Thanks for a short while. The other day down by the shoreline I saw a strange crab. Most striking vibrant color. <sighs> My knees aren't suited for clambering over rocks and chasing crustaceans, you see. But if you caught such a creature, he clears scraps of cloth of paper from his workbench and on a large puzzle and mortar. The right binding agent, we could grind them together for a new mixture. He turns back to you, a cunning plan formed his mind. Fisherman, bring me some of those strange crabs. We'll turn your vessel into work of art. Yeah, but for now, I'll help you with today. Liver flag, adjust bounty. <laughs> Seem to have any new flags. Hmm. Come back. Uh, change flag. Flag do you want to display? Pirate flag. Okay. Oh, we'll just leave. Raider. Well, I don't found anything special lately. Uh, to cargo. Just that ring. I don't think we have anything to research now, not right now. We have rest until the dawn. I'm docked. Go check all of our traps. Pick up. Pick up. Ooh, trophy crab. And pick up. Pick up. So all of our crab things are picked up right now. I'm gonna repair them. See if we could sell. Still early in the morning. Repair all. Alright. Fishmonger. Oh, uh, binding headache. Did you come yesterday? I don't recall. Anyways, what can I do for you? We will sell all fish. Storage. While well, everything. Can't do that yet. Out wood. We are going to undock. We are going on an adventure. Dangerous one. Was 
a fish. Got a bolt of claw. South, it said there is something south. I don't really like being in open water with this little bitty boat. Pet sharks. It is definitely getting creepy now. I don't know if I can remember these to give me any more room. Trying to go to Blackstone Isle. Um, I still go in the right way. No, I'm not. Weird light out there. Dude, this game gets creepy at night, that is for sure. So this is Blackstone Isle. We were headed towards the Gale Cliff. I don't think our little boat yet is ready for that. Mm -hmm. 
soon, but not yet. I'm gonna drive around this little area, see if I see anything really worth. But like, it's like sharks or something. And then throw those into your cargo hold? What in the world? Infected? This has been an interesting game so far. I am enjoying it. Definitely odd. Definitely odd. So that's worth a lot, both of them are decent. What is it? What did you want me to do? Bring two units over two scrap to still point, which is an island just in the north. Perfect. Gotta get used to those. See if there's any other... Oh hey, you got one of the creepy fish next to a shark. Is that island to the north? Looks like we're going straight towards it. Is that? Dude, he is charging full blast. Turned around. Hey, keep an eye out for larger fish. They feed more mouse. I can pay you more for them. Two sixteen, two and three. I mean, we definitely got some money. I'm not finding the research things though. Dude, we got chased all the way into harbor. I'm kind of 
kind of curious like what that whole thing was about. Yeah, I'm not fishing spot. This looks like scrap. They're right next to a dock. materials delivered. So, I do have some of it, it's just in my storage. Definitely take a research part. This is Iron Matilda, we should let the builder know. We will wait until morning. We got a weird ship that's wanting to T-bone us. I do not like that. So we need to go right back. I don't even know if we'll make it in time. Man, we need better engines. See how fast that sun went down. Like, nope, we're getting out of here.
There we get one. Game's definitely getting creepier. Alright, build it. You done it. Well, makes no sense. Waste time, let's get moving. Oh. Uh. <sighs> We're gonna come back when we have more space. Wasn't expecting her to hop on board. We got three. This is Volcanic Shadow. Right now, 15. Really would like a much faster engine. Party crab pot yields. Two per day lasts for five days. Really think the engine. Dang. Spin prop out forward. We need to find one more. Definitely speed us up. Ah. You got it. Well, that's fine. Making. Right. Get rid of it. Great tomorrow. I'm outward bound. Before we do too much. So, 14 and 10. This is 200. Oh, you only had one. Oh. Oh, let us rest. Remember, once you don't have all the materials, you can store them in the dry dock. Two wood, scrap, and one cloth. And gin. There we go. Alright, storage. Let's try going to the dry dock. This gives us modifies two rod spaces to also hold cargo space. Modifies four rod spaces to hold nets. The 
this to be put in anywhere. Oh, another engine can be. This is giving me the option to install it. Never mind. So we should be. Just oh, arrange these a little bit better. It is 5 a.m. We will undock. We're going to start selling towards that point. Yes, this will do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short while to get things built here, and you're welcome back anytime. She reaches the control log, pulls out a handful of components. <laughs> Take these, always good to have on the hand. So we should be able to uh, take those and get that new engine potentially. Yeah, I'm going to do a dangerous thing. I'm going to sell around here to see if there's anything around. It's already in dangerously late. Well, look at that. That is so awesome. Don't eat me. Actually, am I even going the right way? You go more this way. It's late and this could be very dangerous. Rocks came out of nowhere. What is with all the creepy eyes?
Yeah, we're gonna go back in the port. I don't know how you do it every day, these old bones when cut it in high seeds. Do some research. Okay, so we've got this one is coastal and shallow, volcanic shallow. Mangrove and coastal. We can get all these and these. We can get one that does everything. We're getting the wind prop in there. 36. So that should be a little bit faster for us. I don't know how that goes in. We may have to do a little bit more upgrades first. Subscribe, share the video, and comment in the comment section down below. See you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. Peace and God bless.